my light is not cooperating, so I need to give it a couple of slaps at the back. But anyhow, remember that one time I told you guys that we had a particular uh, rehousing session where we had four almost adults, monocentrophus balfouri in a communal. Well, as I said, one of the one of them ended up becoming a matured male, and lo and behold. I send it out to a breeding uh, loan, a breeding loan, sorry. And here's the outcome. We have about 15 to 16 Monocentrophus Balfouri slings in here that was delivered by my friend to my place. Um, yeah, so this is the outcome. So with that, this was its temporary housing. So now we're going to give it a new rehouse where it would be able to last them for quite a while i would say up till almost sub adult stage so here is the entire communal so far seem to be doing very well although yes there's not much inside not much going on inside there's not much like anchoring points and whatnot for them to really turn this enclosure into a winter wonderland it's just a basic uh, temporary setup where he brought it my friend brought it in to me as a delivery as he came over to my place to personally come and see it uh, see it through by uh, passing it uh, passing it to me directly so with that ladies and gentlemen let's take a look at how big the new enclosure is gonna be and how we're gonna prepare it for this communal and we shall see how long it takes them to reach the adult size this is the new enclosure that we're gonna put them in and it's gonna be a big one Let's go! All right, so this is the setup. It's gonna be a lot of space for them as well as a lot of anchoring points. So let's see how are we going to actually accomplish and rehousing these little wanks. Because dang, is this gonna be a tough job rehousing communal. That's gonna be hard. So I'm gonna need both my hands. Tripod, you gotta do your magic. All right, so first up right now, we have to figure out how many they are and let's take a look what the condition is like i'm gonna use both my tweezers to take a look at how they are where they're oh hello look at all of them oh they just cute gotta love these monocentrophus belfouris they look cute when they're small until they become adults they want to end you but nah they are actually one of my more preferred baboon species so we got a few of them here and there now let's see, I'm probably going to use a single uh, single tweezer as well as a catch cup, so that should actually do the trick. So without further ado, let's try to get them in. All right, we got our first uh, candidate for the new home for them, for the new enclosure. So I'm just going to pop it over to the new enclosure while I try to figure out how I'm going to get the others in there. <laughs> it's going to be a tough one, but let's go. I accept this challenge.
So it's about this part where I realized that we have a bunch of runners. We got two of them on the run, so I am forced to actually turn off the camera while I go and catch them all around. I do not want to embarrass myself by re revealing the voices that I'm cursing out at the background, so... Transition time! Now, after that entire ordeal and rehousing them off camera, we have them now at their very new enclosure. As you can see, they're all over the place. They're all over huddling left, right, center. And I did a count and we have 15 heads of Monocentrophus Belfori communal slings. Gotta say, I'm pretty proud of the overall outcome. I take that back. It's actually not that too much of a proud moment because some did escape. Otherwise, it would have been flawless. So, as you can see, one is trying to get all the way up. Go back down. Anyhow, you guys know the drill. If you guys enjoyed the video, smash that like button. If you are new to the channel, do not hesitate to subscribe and hit the no notification bell. And last but not least, for those who are the OGs of this channel, thanks for sticking with me. Do not hesitate to head down to the comment section and, you know, leave down a comment. What do you guys figure out about this uh, video? And with that, ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys for watching. Inverts Paradise, out. <laughs>